the dress code committee was formed and they made some changes to the dress code. Girls have noticed changes such as our shorts can be three inches above the knee, we can wear dress boots any day, and there are jackets that are waiting to be approved by the radio shop. I feel like it's a good life lesson because sometimes you don't always get to make decisions or do what you want. Sometimes you have to do what you're told. And um, so I try to hold the kids accountable regarding dress code all the time, regardless of our dress code being a little more flexible or even a little more harsh. I try to stick to the dress code rules. And then some feedback we got from our students that were on the committee asked for, was looking for some sh type of tops that could be worn over polos. So it, we're not going to anything out of the Raider shop. And there was a little change in footwear too, but not much of a change. Although some changes were seen, many of the dress code rules stayed the same. We still have to wear polos every day, and we cannot wear jeans on a regular basis. Also, any jackets that have not been approved by the Raider shop and are not cannot be worn. This is Grace Sayers with RJTV.